Hi guys, just in London today for our PLAB 2 Communication Skills Day course. Thought I'd do a quick video on seizures and three stages to think about when doing a clinical assessment of a seizure or a first fit, for example. You've got your pre-seizure stage, your intra-seizure stage, and your post seizure stage. Now when you think about your pre-seizure stage, think about how were they beforehand? Was there were they unwell? Did they have any headaches, any vomiting, any fevers, any particular triggers that might have kicked off the seizure in the first place? Then you've got your intra-seizure stage. What happened during the seizure itself? Was there any tongue biting? Was there any incontinence? Was there any eye rolling? Was there any drooling? Was it the whole body affected or just one part, for example? Was there impaired consciousness or was it normal consciousness? Were there any witnesses? Did anyone video it? Can you, can you watch it on a mobile phone, for example? Then you've got your post-seizure stage. So what happened afterwards? How long did it take for them to get back to normality? Was there any headache following it? Was there any drowsiness? Was there any amnesia or memory loss? So if you think about it in three stages, pre, intra, and post, your history or, or clinical data gathering is a lot more effective, a lot more time efficient, and you tend to cover more things. The next time you do a, a data gathering or history about a seizure, think about those three stages, pre, intra, and post-seizure. Hope this helps.